Good morning ladies and gentlemen, I'm ET69 and welcome back to the channel. Today we have another interview and we are with Yoda. Hello Yoda. Good day Meiji. How are you? Yeah, not too bad mate. Good, good, good. Well, welcome to the channel to start off with. Uh, Yoda Jedi Master, if you are not subbed, go sub. Uh, and we're pretty much going to ask the same questions that we asked the the last time, our first ser uh, episode. Yeah. So let's get underway. So Yoda, what is, again, you don't have to answer any of these questions. Uh, it's just a standard set of questions that I thought I'd put together. So uh, I think I know at least half of this one, uh, first one. So what is your name and where do you come from? My name, actual name is Mark, but I go by Yoda Jedi Master. Uh, and where are you from? In Perth, Australia. Nice. Um, I'm actually glad your name's Mark, actually, because uh, I'll be an Australian as well. I know, really only know one Australian called Mark. Uh, do you know who I'm talking about? I'm not too sure. I know a couple. Mark Chopper Reed. Ah, yeah. <laughs> One of my best films ever. Chopper. Amazing. So, uh, what's your YouTube channel? I pretty much said it at the start, but uh, we'll repeat. Yeah. This is Yoda Jedi Master. Yoda Jedi Master. Uh, and it's a pretty unique channel. Obviously, I'm, I'm guessing you like uh, Star Wars. Oh, I love Star Wars. <laughs> So your channel is pretty unique because you, it's not just like myself, like just talking normally. Uh, so if for those that haven't seen your channel, like what, how do you talk in in your in your videos? Like every video, this is not just one video. It's like every video, your commentary is the same. And uh, so, what's that? How is that? Mm. Of the <laughs> Uh, I laugh every time I hear it because, like I said to you at the beginning, I don't know if it's actually being serious or, or you're actually just doing it as uh, some for jokes and giggles. But you're doing it for some jokes and giggle, giggles. Yeah, bit of bit of fun, help people share their you their videos, their gameplay, and it, hopefully people learn from it. Good, good, good. Um, so how long have you been playing, playing Blitz? Ah, uh, since about September 2018, so... Ah, uh, so a couple of years, so you're yeah. not too bad, not too bad. Uh, and what server do you play on? Uh, Asia and NA. NA, and Asia, of course, with the uh, Australian. We've seen Bushka's ping, uh, it's Kieran. He wants to get in on the interview, I do apologise. Uh, oh, no so yeah, the ping... Uh, I mean, I've tried playing Asia myself, and, and it's bad. It's pings for me is bad anyway. So, what's your ping on NA like? Um, NA is slightly higher than Asia, believe it or not, at the moment. Mhm. Mm uh, it sits around about two sixty. Uh, Asia, it's about one sixty. Oh, uh, that's not bad. That's still a lot of ping, like one sixty for Asia, and that's the where you you basically your your region that you play on. Um, that's cool. like my ping when I play on EU. Um, sometimes I'm on like five ping. It, it's crazy, and I get around 160 on on NA as well. So it's well, that's not too bad. But 160 is your standard server. I think that's that's pretty rough. Um, At least it stays steady, so it doesn't. Yeah, that's that's what I've said to other people. Like if it's steady 160 ping or two 200 ping, then it's not too bad. It's when it fluctuates up and down like quite rapidly that's when it's uh, that's when it's a bit shit um so uh what other games uh, no hang on what what's your win rate what's your win rate again you don't have have to say it's on asia it's almost 57 percent after what is it 34k games not bad so you're and above average yeah and i i'm sitting at 67 percent with about six thousand games nice nice so you're uh, a fairly good player I would uh, say. <laughs> uh, and what other games do you play? Uh, mainly play this, and now and then I play Age of Empires, number three. Ooh, nice. I don't literally play any other game. I just don't don't have time for any other game. Yeah. I've uh, played most of the day. 
I mean, I like Blitz. I like Blitz, and it's crazy to see a, a, a mobile game like last so long, which is what I said in, in my other interview as well. But I, I absolutely love the Blitz, and if you see my video, well, it's it's hard for me. Like, today's video that I released, which by the time this video goes out, it'll be a couple of days ago about the missiles, it's such a shame because for me, it's just ruining the game, and it's not so fun no more and i don't like that because i've got no other game to sort of back up on either it's this is my what i do and if i don't play blitz i literally will not know what to do so i'm hoping it gets sorted i'm hoping but i, I hope so too but i notice a lot of players are playing tier 7 and down there uh-huh it's Staying away from the higher tiers. have you played them all have you played the missiles i haven't got the missile tank yet uh, you um, just come up against them. I'll come up against them, but yeah, it, I don't play that often up there now. No, <laughs> understandable, understandable. So, uh, I do, I'll get a TD and try to... <laughs> best way, best way. So, uh, what do you want for your channel? What are you looking to get from your channel? I'd love to get at least five to six K of subscribers or mm -hmm. more. Cool. So, a nice target. That's a nice target to, to set, to be honest, because uh, how many subs are you on, on now? I mean, you don't have uh, too many. Uh, up to 141. So, just recently. good. Hopefully with this, obviously, I, I uh, you posted a a missile tank of mine, which I, uh, I sent to you and gained a few subs. So hopefully with this kind of video, you will gain subs because it is a unique channel, guys. Like, it might not be everyone's cup of tea, which I understand. I absolutely hate Star Wars. I'm not lying. I can't stand it. But I still like this channel and I still laugh every time I watch a video because it's just funny. Whether you like Star Wars or not, it's funny. Leave my mic alone. You just turned my mic off. Look, <laughs> go, off, go yeah, away. I get quite a few people that say, yeah, they just laugh and enjoy it. And that's what you want as a YouTuber. That's, what, that's, that's the kind of comments you want. Is, uh, but if I, if I can start earning a little bit of money from YouTube, I'll actually put it back into the game, offer prizes and things like that. Yeah. Do competitions. Well, hopefully uh, we can well, get you there. Wonder. Hopefully we can get you there, get you to that at least minimum thousand subs so you can start monetizing your channel. And like I said, it is such a unique channel. There's no other channel that does anything like this. So I do apologize for Kieran. Stop, stop. Uh, <laughs> So, d d d how many subs do you have, which we've got? What's your favourite tank in the game? Um, believe it or not, I love the grill. Oh, I love the grill. And, and RHM. RHM. See, I love the grill. It's probably one of my favourite TDs. But I hate the RHM Borzik. Absolutely. I can't stand it. I don't know why. It's... I, I just... I don't know. I don't know why. But it's just a tank I can't get on with. But yet, I love the waffle. I think I probably love the waffle more than the grill. The, the waffle is just a beautiful tank. Uh, it, and it works in tier 10 as well, which is what I like. <laughs> so, not not bad favourite yeah. tank, grill. I love love the TD range. Love mm -hmm. the heavy range. Don't mind the mediums. Not very good on the lights. So basic, pretty and all round. It's the same again, same as me. I like, I like pretty much any. I'm not really a TD player or a heavy player or a medium. It's just all round. So uh, nice, nice. So what's your least? What's your least favourite tank? Anything that you tier four and down now. They've just ruined the uh -huh. tanks. Yep. They have. What do you think about while we're talking about? What do you think about the the update five point five? Mm, not a fan. With the release, uh, with the removal of all the lower tier tanks and the nerfs, etc. It's uh, yeah. at first. I mean, I got slated for this at first because I said, like, guys, it's not a big problem. It's like there's still other tanks, but over some time, it's become a big problem because people are starting to grind the line a lot quicker they're getting up to tier 10s i mean on my free to play account i have what 200 battles not even that and i'm on tier 8 already just after 200 battles it's it's crazy and and it's taking the fun out of it it, it has 
people can use. That's it. We can't use anymore. No, that's it. And the, the same. Collected, like I've collected on my Azure account, but yeah. I don't have them on the in Azure account. No, it's the same as like tanks like the Panzer 2J, the tier 3. That was once such a fun tank to play because of the armor, even though it never was been able to really penetrate anything. Um, but now it's just like, it's one of the worst tanks in the game. I don't know if you've got it or if you've played it recently, but it just can't pen anything. It's stupid. They've, And even if you have to switch to Pramo, you're doing less damage as well. So something like the Panda 2J is, is so bad. It's so bad now. And... A lot of them just came up today as birthday tanks. Uh huh. <laughs> I counted 87 tanks. Oh fucking hell! So, so you're going to be busy. <laughs> going to be busy. Yeah, <laughs> um. Next question. Again, just like I said to to Scott, you don't have to and don't feel you have to answer this and say me. But who's your favourite YouTuber? Who uh, who makes you um want to do th something like this? And um. I started off with like in Bushka, believe it uh -huh. or not. Yeah, yeah. Then, then I went off him a bit. But I, I really love Skate. Yep. And I've actually missed his YouTubes. Yeah, we all have. We all have. I mean, everyone I ask this question as YouTuber wise is the the same answer is, is normally Bushka because he he's what got me started. To be honest, yeah. Bushka's who got yeah, me started. Yeah. He helped my gameplay once somebody put me onto him. I was a like a forty two percenter. Mm-hmm. And that was about eight thousand games. Yeah. Fucking hell. So somebody you... put me on onto him and I grinded and grinded and got it up to almost fifty seven percent now. Nice, nice, nice. Um it's a shame that he's actually uh doing more PUBG, but it's it's where the money's at. I mean, PUBG pay him, and that it's his job. Do you know what I mean? He, he hasn't got a. He left his job to do this full time, so no one can really blame him. If if Wargaming start paying him, then he might come back because he's got to go where the money is. I mean, it's his job, but at least he he still does the content. I mean, I'm, I I watch every single one of his videos. I'm a good friend of Bushka. Met him a few times in real life, and that's the same as Skate. Skate. Uh huh. Yep. Pretty, very good video very good video that was and that was the reason I, that made me make my missile because the more i think the more youtubers that talk about how broke these missiles is uh especially cc's the more chance we've got to remove the freaking things but uh skate i mean i miss skate skate's one of my best friends like in i know him personally as well i mean we had things planned and he, he's just disappeared i mean just gone over three months without a video i i've even texted his phone like i've got his number i've texted him twice nothing nothing in return so i'm going to result in i think texting his wife just to say oh, yeah, tell him to freaking message me because everyone's yeah. worried about him like it just oh, disappears I've, I've you know from discord he he's one of the ones that's always got back from me. yeah he, he does and that's yeah. what i like that's what I love about Skate, and he's so down to earth, and he'll—he's just a nice guy. Like, and he's like this in in real life as well. Like in person, he's such a nice guy. You can have a laugh with him. He's got some humour, but he just disappeared, and I don't know where he is. He's—he's he's gone. Um, yeah, most of the CCs I really like. I try to follow most of them when I can. Mm-hmm. Good, 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 good. First thing in the morning, cup of tea. <laughs> and watch most of the youtubes that that's what i do like i wake up in the morning because my wife's at work it's uh, i have to get up for the kids and take them all to school and that their school now is half because we moved their school's half an hour drive away uh so i get up and the first thing i do is pick up my phone put youtube on and my daughter's in my ear dad get up get up i'm like yeah in a minute and i'm trying to hide my phone for, like so she don't know i'm on it because she'll just ring my wife and say mum he's on youtube and, and i'll just get it in the neck so it's exactly what i do and i think a lot of people do that i think as soon as they get up it's like priority and it? it's just like don't talk to me until i've watched my video it's it becomes life is 
that's it. It becomes part of your life. And when you, it's a routine at the end of the day, and it's just like smoking. People will smoke because it's like a, a routine. It's it's hard to give up. Uh, and it's just like watching videos. It's the first thing you do. And sometimes it's the last thing I do. I put YouTube on in bed, see what's there, have a nose. It's just like scrolling through Facebook, you know, but you just scroll through YouTube to see what's there. I actually watched uh, on YouTube last night, Tanker. Right. And it's done on a real life Russian. Mm hmm. And it's about the. Cl 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 oh, can't say the word. <laughs> Gold medal or something like that. Where oh, all right. And his tank crew killed, took out a whole bunch of Russian tanks, personnel carriers, and all that. Oh, all right, cool. I haven't uh, come across that. But it sounds interesting. Cool. A um, couple more questions. What, what hobbies do you have? Uh, blitz, mostly. Mm -hmm. Um, if I get out, which is not very often, <laughs> I like to do a bit of photography. Yep, yeah, cool. So I, I, I suffer with a lot of chronic pain, back yeah. pain and that. So yeah. I don't get out very often. Oh, no, so photography's pretty good. I'm sure that will, uh, help you in your channel as well, like with thumbnails, etc. You, you should, uh, have a sort of knack for... To build your channel with your photography so uh not bad not bad so uh are you it's obviously you're not at school uh are you studying you work or are you just uh, at home at yeah. 40, uh -huh. now. so that's how long i've been putting up with back pain and knee problems ah that that sucks Four that sucks on, carpet lane. Mm -hmm. ah that so, sucks yeah, forcibly retired me and my wife on full-time care if I do try to walk around, sometimes I collapse. Yeah. Oh, that's that's uh that's shit to hear. But uh, I hope you're doing so, okay I, in yourself. Like, today, so. not bad. <laughs> not bad. <laughs> if you get something good out of it, I suppose. <laughs> and I've made some good friends. Like, um, uh, well, I've made friends with Bushka yourself. Mm -hmm. Skate. Um, Little Finger. Yep. He's just become yeah, yeah. About a thousand people now. Uh, yeah, he's he's requested. Taken. Yeah, these are all good guys. Like uh, both of them. Yeah. Last one, every good name is a good friend. Littlefinger is a great YouTuber. I'll be interviewing him at one point, which he he has asked. So, so uh, yeah. So that brings us on to the last question. Uh, what made you play Blitz? Um, How did I you get into it. Blitz? I played a different game before, which was called um, Battle Pirates, mm -hmm. and that ended up having becoming very money orientated. Yep. <laughs> money you didn't get anywhere. And you, you Sounds get familiar to stuff. Blitz. Yeah. Uh, it's actually worse than Blitz. Yeah. Blitz, and it's got a lot of hackers. Oh, nice. So after playing three, four years on that game, I gave it up. Yep. My son, son said, why didn't you try this game? It's playing with tanks and short games. Yeah. And I haven't stopped playing. Since. Yeah, it's exactly the same. My, my workmate got me into, into this game. It's uh, We used to play just stupid little games. And at work, we used to, when we had nothing to do, like we work in a warehouse and we used to just get some shrink wrap uh, and sellotape uh, together and play football in the warehouse. And then he, he come across this game, and it's just like, I have no idea about tanks in real life. Like, they don't really interest me. But it was like, come on, down, download the game. So we I downloaded it. I had a couple of games, and I was just like, you know what, this is shit. Uh, and I uninstalled it, and then a couple of days or a couple of weeks later, he was like, no, come on, we can actually play together. We can platoon. I was like, what, can we? Download it again. Like, we was, I didn't even know you could platoon. So we downloaded it again. And uh, we at this time, we actually thought that you need to have a clan and be in the same clan as each other to platoon. So he grinded a million credits just to buy the the clan uh, so we could platoon. And we found out that you didn't even need to do that anyway. So uh, and then what? five years later, here, here we are. We're still playing it. He's still playing it. He, we're in the same clan together still. We sit at work we, together. We platoon. And five years later, it's crazy. <laughs> I actually started playing in 2016. Mm-hmm. So. Okay, now, so four years. Yeah. And that's what you thought, two years, and it's, yeah. that's how quick it goes. Yeah. 
but I'm making friends all around the world, which is mm-hmm. beautiful. Which is great. It's it's that's yeah. that's what I love most about Blitz uh, is the community side. Yes, there is some tox toxic uh, yeah, people, but it's just most the majority are just all so nice people and it's great to be able to see i mean you're in australia i'm in england and we're just sat here talking about the game we love do you know what i mean it's yeah, it's great it is great so uh that's it that is it thank you uh for joining people go subscribe the link will be in the description below it's a very unique channel if even if you don't like star wars it is still a funny channel so go check them out go subscribe uh and thank you yoda for coming on it's been a pleasure talking to you and this is the first time we've like ever spoke as well so so uh, i just wanted to show that like i've had so many people ask me to do interviews and a lot of them are patrons a lot of them are friends that have channels and i'm like like guys i've just done a friend let me do other people that i've never spoke to um and then we'll get to you at some point so it's uh our first time talking and it's uh, it's been fun it's been fun and uh, i enjoyed it hopefully you <laughs> <laughs> oh, I laugh every time you say it. Just before we started recording, Kieran, went, hang on, hang on a minute. Kieran would come up to me, so I put, I put the headphones on him, and Yoda was talking to him, and he had the biggest. I wish I would have recorded it because he had the biggest smile on his face, and it was hilarious. So uh, yeah, keep keep up the good work, mate. Keep up the good work, uh, and I'm sure you you will. I'm sure you will grow soon. So thank you all. Thank you all for watching again. Go subscribe and we will see you all very soon. Bye bye.